Hello, visionaries. Welcome back to Akin channel. Atkan Bango Galantito. Welcome. And today, let's react to another episode of RuPaul's Drag Race Philippines Season 2. And this episode is the season finale episode. The day is finally here. And we are going to see who is going to be the next crown reigning queen of this season. But first, you guys know I pick a comment from last video. And the comment that I chose today was... I really don't like Jade so because I don't understand the world that she is in. But I'll say she deserved the last Rue badge. The story behind her outfit hit me hard and I'm not even trans. I love it. Thank you so much for that comment, babe. I total, totally do appreciate it. Let me know what you guys think about this episode down in the comment section below. And I cannot wait to see what you guys have to say for the season finale. And speaking about the season finale, I want to give a huge shout out to my Filipino people that are from there, that still live there, that really educated me as well as others that are foreign um, from the culture, um, provided us with a lot of details and things that we definitely missed throughout this season. Season. So thank you so much. And thank you to everyone that has joined me throughout this season. This has been an amazing wild ride and I totally do appreciate it. And if you guys have been loving my content, please give this video a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, that notification bell, and share this video on all your social media platforms. And all of my social medias, my website, my Patreon, my PO box, and the Discord are going to be located in the description box below. So make sure you guys check that out. I have started a new segment on my channel called The Library is Open on Sunday Night Lives, 8 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Make sure you guys don't miss it. And also, it is my birthday coming up. So shout outs to all the Libras out there. If you guys want to support me and my channel, you guys can click the thanks button right underneath this video to give me a nice tip or my B-Day Amazon wish list is in the description box below. So make sure you guys check that out. And if you guys want to join my YouTube membership family, just click the join button right next to my name underneath this video as well. And without further ado, you guys, let's get ready to react to RuPaul's Drag Race Philippines season finale to see who is going to be our next reigning queen of the Philippines. To me, Miss Captivating Cat Cat is going to come out sickening in being the winner. Yes, Miss Captivating Cat Cat had the best, literally, season so far. Miss Arizona Brandy, we just fell in love with her. You can't help but to love her. Okay, they're bringing back the girls on season two. I'm happy they got their little shine too as well, because they deserve it. Okay, Miss Astrid, you look cute. Asher, that's a good solid look. I love this look. Miss Tiny, I love this. This is cute. This is cute for you. I wish the waist piece was a little shorter, like, you know, lower. But otherwise, it's still a good dress. Oh, my God. Baby, this look that Miss Varushka has is drop dead freaking gorgeous. Okay. I'm not really ecstatic. Ace is not even ecstatic about it. Okay, she is a snake villain of the season. I totally get her concept. That's exactly what she channeled throughout the season. And this is exactly what she got. And it's in realized form now. Okay, OV, I do like this ensemble, but honestly, I wish you had a wig underneath that little headpiece because I wish you would have curls or something coming through to frame your face. But otherwise, it's still a good look. Okay, Miss Hannah Beshi. I see where you were going, but the execution of this, it kind of fell short and it kind of fell flat. There's a lot of editing that you could have done with this look. Okay, Miss Mama Pal, you better give us your whole introduction, your whole your whole music video. I know that's right, but girl, hurry up, girl. I'm, I want to see these top four now. Come on. Oh, Miss Mama Pal said she's going to give you a whole lip sync performance too, girl. She said, don't forget about me. I am the OG. I don't know if she is not trying to perform this song in full out, but I think she needs to do it. And she needs to do it now. She looks gorgeous. I wish she had a better ensemble on, but it is what it is. You know what, Mama Pow? I appreciate the effort that you're giving us, but honestly, I could have done without it. Okay, you brought the girls back in for the last choreo of the season. I like that. I really do like that aspect. You brought the girls back, you know? Okay, well, I'm glad that the girls know some of the choreography. I would like to take this opportunity to applaud all of you. 
Yes, applaud all the season two queens. They deserve it. Absolutely love that. Let's go, ladies. Okay, wildlife couture extravaganza. Let's see what they got. Okay, Miss Bernie, you're giving me tribal. You're giving me eagle at the same time. You're claiming your tribe. You're claiming the win. And I'm here for it. The details, the look, everything is sickening. Oh, by Miss Bernie. And you better give us and you better sell this ensemble to its fullest, baby. I see that you were trying to do a cheetah. But girl, the look is just not it to me. Even though I know that you're trying to be shocking and looking the floor and all the extra jazz that you're doing and selling it, but this look is not it. I'm sorry, it's just not. Okay, honestly, Miss Jade, so honestly, Miss Jade, so I expected a lot more from you and a lot better looks from you because I felt like you can you you can wear this on any like red carpet or just like a an event. You know, it's nothing. Wow. Oh, yes, Miss Captivated Cat Cat. You literally is, you, you are literally a horse and carriage baby waiting to get drawn in to get your crown. Like, honestly, this is perfection. The hair is great. The makeup is on. You literally have a full carriage on your back. You gave us props and presentation. And this is what the category is calling for. Great job. Okay, Precious Stones is this next category. Oh, I love the wings, Bernie. The wings are gorgeous. The colors are great. And she's giving me Phoenix vibes with this Ruby-esque situation. The hair, the makeup, how she sold it, and how she's moving and maneuvering on this runway is so sickening to me. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's cute. Okay, so it's funny. I like that she's giving very camp with this look. I get what she's going with because that's her shtick of being drunk and liquor and everything. But is it a solid look? It's a cute look. It's not bad. It's better than her first. Okay, Miss Jade, you picked actually a jade stone, which I like and I enjoy the fact that you chose that stone. The look is great. The headpiece is great. The spear is great. The way you're selling it is fun. You look good. Your body is amazing. And of course, you're drop dead gorgeous. Don't break that. Yes, girl. She better break. She better tear down the stage with her crown. I know that's right. Yes, she picked the ruby. And honestly, she's speaking stuff into fruition. It says queen on her chest, baby. She is demanding the crown. She is here for the crown. And she's going to get the crown. And Captivating Cat Cat, you look freaking amazing. And overall, there was drama. She, fun, and a heavy dose of, wow, but that's what you need from a good freaking season. Mm. What a freaking season this was. You're so right. Okay, best drag elegance. Let's see what they got. You know what, Bernie? This is such a good freaking look. It is so strong. But the only issue I'm going to start saying now is that if you look at all your looks, they look all of this. They, they, they look all the same. It's the same style, same aesthetic. I wish you would give me something different because it, it is very well made. There's a lot of detail. It looks gorgeous. If, you, if it's on its own, it's perfect. But if you look at it all as a package deal, you're like, okay, I've seen this thing before. You know, you look gorgeous. The hair color, the makeup, the gown, everything about this is drag excellence. This is such a good look. The best look that you had on stage. And this is where you need to bring it out in at the end to get your crown. And Miss Arizona Brandy, you look phenomenal. I am having my own ball. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Girl, she's in the old world again. It's a wish that's heart made. Ah, she's quoting Disney. I love her even more. Miss Jade, you look great. I do wish that the bottom piece of the dress was different and then the bottom of it, you can see the underskirt and everything and it's not really looking well. Your hair, your makeup, the corset piece is gorgeous. Yeah, you can see underneath the dress, it's kind of, a, it's, it's unfortunate. Close the lights, I can't. She better cut, she better instruct the P production. Okay, Miss Captivating Cat Cat, I see you girl giving us 
Oh, what is she's literally doing international costume. Okay, I'm here for this. She said, girl, I'm going to take every inch of this stage because it is mine. This is a gorgeous look, Miss Cat Cat. The queen that you voted as Miss Congeniality. Miss Congeniality, it has to go to Hannah Beshi since Bernie is already top four. Okay, Miss Lily, Lady Morgana said this is my moment. I love that the Philippines, they conduct everything so pageantry, which I f***ing love it. Oh, that was so good. Good job. Hannah Beshi. Shake the <laughs> for Hannah Beshi. Good job, Miss Hannah Beshi. You deserved it. You deserve that. Okay, she says she's going to run around the whole stage. May you have an amazing reigning season of Miss Congeniality, Miss Hannah Beshi. Mama Power, you look great right here. Oh, they're doing the roulette on who is going to be chosen. Okay. And the process of elimination, the top, the last two queens left will be lip syncing for the crown. Got it. I just hope and pray we get Cat Cat versus Jade lip syncing because of the drama earlier out this season. Just finish it out with that. The girls are ready. Hopefully they give us something sickening. Oh, captivating Cat Cat is the first queen to be chosen. Miss Jade, Miss Jade, Miss Jade, please. Oh, but it's okay. We got the two top contenders of the season battling it out early, okay? Arizona brand name is Jade, second round of lip syncing. All right, we gonna see how that goes. Oh no, they got RuPaul songs, what the? F Why did you guys do that, Philippines? Why? Why couldn't you just save enough coins for just a good song? Just what they want. Oh my goodness. Oh my god, this is crazy. The best queens of this season are going at it first. Oh my god. Oh my god, why am I so freaking nervous right now? I really want Miss Cat Cat to win though. I really want her to slay this. But Miss Bernie is not going to give her an easy fight. Okay, Miss Bernie's already doing a reveal. Okay, Miss Bernie. Yes, Miss Cat Cat. Yes, the girls better give us a good damn lip sync. Oh, Miss Cat Cat's about to break it on down. Miss Cat Cat, please give us something. Give us something. Reveal, do something. I know you got something underneath that damn dress. Oh, oh Miss Bernie, you're doing some low-key trashy voguing over there. I don't like the voguing, girl. Yes! <laughs> she said, girl, boom. She said, I'm going to give you butt hole naked. Yes, Miss Cat Cat, give us it. Give us everything that we want, honey. Oh, okay, Miss Bernie said, I got a little bit more to take off. Oh, did Miss Cat Cat just go off the stage? Oh, yeah! <laughs> she rolled off into a different wig. Miss, did Miss Cat Cat just get the mop? Did she do, is she mopping the floor with her? Is that what she's giving? <laughs> the shade. <laughs> okay, the girls are fighting for this. Oh, Miss, oh, it's another damn hair reveal. Miss Bernie gave us three looks. Honestly, this is going to be so, oh. Miss Cat Cat said, no, girl, I got this too, baby. Oh, Miss Cat Cat's doing cartwheels and splits. Yeah. <laughs> She's doing the snake on the floor, girl. What is going on? Girl, okay. Honestly, it's an okay lip sync. I expected for them to do so much better than this. Oh, wowzers. Okay. Wow, okay. Well, the girls really showed out. I wish it was a little bit better than that lip sync, but I'll take what I can get. If I had to pick one, not biased. The winner of the first Captivating Cat Cat. The mopping of the floor was winner. Captivating Cat Cat. Yeah! <laughs> Shake for the girl. <laughs> oh, but Bernie is gone now. Bernie didn't win. Oh, I'm happy for Cat Cat, but then I'm so sad for Bernie. It's just the beginning for you, Miss Bernie. Yes, trans revolution for the win, darling. That's Fem Queen Finger for that. 
yes we all have joy in our heart for you as well miss bernie Mm -hmm. I really cannot wait for her to come to the States on any franchise, any season. She's going to be great for an All-Stars or versus the world. All right, girl. Come on, Miss Jade and Miss Arizona Brandy. Give us what we need on this second round. Who is she? Girl, these lip sync, these songs for these, the season finale is just really crap, to be honest. Miss Jade seems ready, baby. That whole outfit looks great. The delusional performance. Girl, hope it's not delusional, girl. I hope it's a sickening performance. Okay, Miss Arizona Brandy. Okay, Miss Jade, girl, you gave us a reveal with that. Of course, we expect nothing but body from you. Yes, Miss Arizona. Let's see what you got underneath this coat. That's right, bitch. So far, the girls are doing pretty good with lip syncing the song, though. No shame. Yes, Miss Arizona, give us confetti. Give us something that give us a prop. Um, Miss Jade, are you gonna are you gonna lip sync the song, or are you gonna just be sickening on stage? <laughs> Please, I don't know. All right, Miss Jade, you look gorgeous, Miss Jade. But Miss Arizona Brandy, right next to you, is shutting it all the way down. Yes, <laughs> Miss Arizona Brandy said, "Girl, look at me lip syncing this song." Miss Arizona Brandy is giving me a performance. She's giving me, bitch, I'm here to get paid and I'm here for my crown. Did she take out the contacts? Oh my God, yes. She is not eating the contacts. Oh my God. <laughs> Thumb queen finger. <laughs> Miss Arizona Brandy slayed this. Miss Jade, I'm sorry, baby. I don't know, at this point, she mopped the floor with you. Jade, I understand that you're trying and you're going, trying to get there, but at the end of the day, I don't think there's not so much you can do right now to, to really win and redeem yourself. Now she changes shape every night. <laughs> Nothing, what the tea? <laughs> Miss Arizona Brandy slayed that. I mean, Miss Arizona Brandy, girl. That is a performance that we would tip our good money for. Arizona Brandy, you cleared, cleared that performance. Best lip sync performance of the season from you. Arizona Brandy, there's no question. Yeah! <laughs> Shake for Miss Arizona. <laughs> Arizona, you slayed that you did that you deserved that you left no crumbs you mopped the floor you freaking excelled at that performance and honestly just by that performance what you gave now and your energy level that you're giving me miss cat cat should be very scared at this point this could be arizona brandy's crown i am shook right now no way i was eliminated <laughs> Jade, you're f***ing crazy. Out of all the cast, I need Miss Jade So to be on a Versus the World or any other franchise, all stars, before anybody else. Because she is going to give us good TV and good looks and she's amazing to look at. You didn't just eliminate me. I eliminated myself. <laughs> <laughs> she's a f***ing nut. She's still going. She literally went into the light and took off. I cannot. She's hilarious. We love Miss Jade. Come on, Miss Precious. She better come back with a bang, honey. Looking drop dead gorgeous. Just in the time, uh, wear your crown, not just in your head, but in your heart. Oh, that was cute. Now, as far as this last, last lip sync goes, I'm gonna be very unbiased. And I'm going to keep it very real. Who wins this lip sync should win the crown. It all coming down to this, baby. It is all coming down to this. Oh, good. Thank you for the song choice. I got butterflies in my stomach. I'm so nervous. I don't know why. Oh, my God. Arizona could really take this fucking crown, you guys. And it would be worthy because she slayed the lip, the last lip sync. Oh, <laughs> yes, with the smoke. 
Okay, Miss Kitty Cat. Passion. Emote Arizona Brandy. Let me know down in the comments, you guys, what this song is talking about because I would love to know. This is a very passionate song just by the tone and the lyric, the, the sound of it. Okay. Both revealed and dear tear off at the same time. It was great timing. Time is everything to a lip sync performance and they're doing just that. They both look amazing on this stage. They're giving me looks, they're giving us passion, and they're giving us a good lip sync. Honestly, it's going to be very hard to choose between who is lip syncing better than the other because it seems like they're both on the same level. Okay, yes, Miss Cat Cat looking at the crown, lip syncing to it. Okay, make us feel it, baby. Give us the chills down our spines. Oh, they both took a freaking flag out. That is freaking crazy. They did that. I love that. Oh, I want to cry. Trans flag and then the gay pride flag. Oh my god, that is so good. Right at the same time, this is what I'm talking about. They're both on the same level of performing, and they're doing so good. Yes, and another reveal from Miss Cat Cat. Trans women are women. Yeah, it's the message for me. Oh, I'm. Oh, we're done. It done. Miss Cat Cat signed, sealed, and delivered it with that message. Both did amazing, but Cat Cat at the end took that crown. Okay, this pre-recorded in 1982, and then they're gonna play it now. Okay. We hope we are making you proud. We love you, Mama. Oh, you definitely making her proud, baby, because the ratings are lit. The time has come to crown our queen, the winner of Drag Race Philly Queen. Miss Cat Cat. The Philippines' next drag superstar. Miss Cat Cat. Captivating. <laughs> yes. Oh my god, I'm so happy for you! Because it really could have went either way, and I'm happy that she won. Well, not only because she deserved it, because she had a great track record, because she gave us great looks, because she gave us uh, an evolving, realized character, storyline, character development, and everything and all in between. And people that hated on her and, and, and just really dislike her, you guys have to just understand people grow and evolve from the people that they were and let them show that they can do that. And I don't believe in cancel culture. I'm gonna call uh, the first ever trans women contestant in Miss Universe. Oh my God, it's gonna make me cry. I just need to be here. Oh yes. My love letter and style, love Arizona brand. Oh. Well, no, it doesn't end. It's just a new beginning and a new chapter that everyone is going to want to freaking read because you're amazing, Miss Arizona Brandy. Not only the fact that she killed the lip syncs, let's just be real, she nailed the lip syncs. She did good. The last one could have been either way, whatever. But you have to look at the whole episode in general. The runways, the way that she performed, the way that she sold it. And also, even if you don't want to take just this episode, you got to look at the track record and what they did throughout the season. Capt had had the best, she's the, she was the top contender to win this season. And the final episode just solidified that. Such a good f***ing season. I love Drag Race Philippines. Okay, visionaries, that is the end of my reaction to RuPaul's Drag Race Philippines grand finale. Congratulations, Cat Cat, for taking the crown, for winning it, for having an amazing season like you did. Congratulations to all the contestants throughout the season. Thank you guys so much for joining me on this crazy wild ride. Make sure you guys stay tuned in for the library is open Sunday night live at 8 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Turn on all post notifications. We are going to be talking about this grand finale that um, on Sunday. So stay tuned in for that. Again, my birthday Amazon wish list is going to be in the description, as well as if you want to send me some love and a tip, hit the thanks button right underneath this video so you guys can do that and please join my youtube membership family so you guys can have access to special custom created emojis that i make just for you guys and thank you guys for sharing liking commenting and sending me so much love my heart is totally full and this concludes my reactions for rupaul's drag race philippines season two hopefully you guys stay stick with me throughout this year until next season um, uh, from my reactions and my reviews and everything that i have going on on my channel but 
season three. I'm looking right at you and it's going to be an amazing, great season. So like always, you guys, life is your vision. It is whatever you make it, as long as you make it freaking fabulous. Until the next one. Bye.